Salman Khan is back in action with his latest release Antim that has hit the theaters on the 26th of November. But this time around, it's not him who's doing the bhaigiri, but his brother-in-law Ayush Sharma, who stars as a local ghoul and performs a performance so stellar that he outshines even Salman Khan in the frames that he's sharing with him. Mahesh Manjrekar directs this movie and despite its flaws, it's kind of a one-time watch. Now, this movie is a remake of the 2018 Marathi film Mulchi Patel. And unlike much of the Salman Khan stars, this movie does not revolve around him and he's not the central character. The storyline of the movie revolves around poor farmers being forced and threatened to leave their lands to the powerful men. Ayush Sharma plays Rahulia, a farmer's son who will remind you a lot of Sanjay Dutt's character in Vastav with his all-black ensembles and his gold chains. Ayush Sharma also manages to impress in the scenes he shares with Salman Khan, one of them in which he shares an impromptu fighting sequence where both of them are just shirtless. What comes as a surprise to me is the very fact that Salman Khan in a very long time is not the central character of the movie. Salman's character is very different from the cops he has played in Wanted and in Dabang. He takes a break from being his bhai self and in this one delivers a subtle performance with his powerful lines. Debutant Mahima Makwana plays Ayush Sharma's love interest and with just a few lines stands out with her performance. Director Mahesh Mandrekar also stars in this movie as Mahima's drunkard father and delivers a stellar performance just like the original movie. The music by Hidesh Mohak and Ravi Basrool include high-octane action songs like Koi To Aiga and Bhai Ka Birthday, which actually induce the right amount of energy into your screens. We also get to see Varun Dhawan in a very special song towards the climax of the movie, which includes him dancing on a Ganesh Aarti while the bad guys are being fought and hit in the background. Now this really reminds you of the typical cliché soundtracks and the sequences used in 80s and 90s. The second half of the movie could have been cut shorter, but to keep the audiences engaged, I think the songs were also very needed. Antim will undoubtedly become the game changer of Ayush Sharma's career, in which he delivers a stellar and remarkable performance. If you're looking for a high action octane performance this weekend, go watch Antim in theatres near you.